I think they are the best attacking team in terms of the patterns that they implement. They, it's it's really fun to watch them play football, especially when they're attacking when they're on the front foot. For so Spurs, finishing <laughs> in the top three is like a title. Like it's like a cup yeah, for them yeah. so by their standards. I generally win things in my second season. Is Bing Ange just like big on talks or do you think it's possible? He's been a smooth talker till now. So if that's his persona, yeah. let him go with it. But he has to perform. Otherwise, I mean, if he performs, that's good. You know, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure he'll move on from Spurs, whatever. And if he doesn't perform, also it's good entertainment for us to see <laughs> all the Spurs fan, fans getting uh, frustrated again and the yeah. whole Ange aura crumbling down so we'll see but they've been pretty shaky so far this season right yeah and uh, I think they have everything like what it takes to at least finish in the top four so I think we'll see I think I don't think it will be considered a failure if they don't win the Premier League because other than delusional Spurs fans I don't think anyone else (laughs) is expecting them to do that but I think, uh, I think wait, wait. top three, think, top three will be like I think a reasonable expectation. Yeah. Vegans was referring to a Vegans was referring to a Carabao Cup, bro, not Premier League. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. For Spurs, for Spurs, finishing in the top three is like a title. Like it's like a cup yeah, for them yeah. so, by their standards. <laughs> so no, it's think, fine. Think, yeah, no, but I think I think Spurs really should kind of go the ten hard way. I mean, not entirely in terms of context. But in terms of the trophies of things, because the fans have been so starved, man. Like, can you please give something, a card about them, <laughs> something, and a fake up? Just, just focus on that. Just get something so that you can build on the next season. Because, unlike United, they have a good backroom staff. They have, you know, the way Daniel Levy is operating things at the stadium. Don't and forget about the stadium, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And they have NFL a good deal. to build on. Yeah, exactly. So, they, they can be. All that fans want is. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, just win something so that we can have some sort of like, okay, we are fine, we are still existing, we are living, and then we think and think about Premier League and all of that. Right? Because for them finishing in Champions League and finishing in top four, I mean, they've done that in the last uh, two or three times in the last like six or seven seasons, but then nothing comes out of but nothing kind of materializes for them once they are in Champions League. So, top four, top three, I don't think they would want it so much as much as they would want the trophy. I really think that they just go for the reason and they should not just grow up in this early around. They should take every round as its final and then just go for the trophies. So I think that's what Ange should do. At least to kind of make sure the people believe in things. And then mm-hmm. they can start building for other trophies. Because if they are going to think that, okay, I finished third this season, no trophies. Yeah, that feeling will stick for a bit. Okay, we'll okay, hear the Champions League on the next season. But what of it? What yeah. are you going to show for it? There's nothing there. Yeah, think, vibes. Uh, they have vibes to show vibes. for it. Vibes. Yeah, I think I think one of the biggest things with Spurs is that they can't defend, dude. Like, uh, I mean, they have good defenders, they have good players, but they can't defend as a collective, and that's my biggest worry for them. I mean, not worry, but like actual hope that they it long that you know this continues for for the duration of the season because <clears> I mean they have pretty good attackers. They are, I think, they are the best attacking team in terms of the patterns that they implement. They, it's it's really fun to watch them play football, especially when they're attacking, when they're on the front foot. But then if they don't score two or three goals quickly, or like, you know, mm. what the opponent does, then they're basically, they will let uh, goals in. And that's the biggest problem with them, right? So even in the cups, that is my biggest worry. And that again is a structural worry, same as Ten Hag. Ten Hag is a stupid, fuck but this guy is i think focuses or chooses not to do that that thing and that is that might be his downfall because that's what happened last year where his fall I, th- I think they can i think they can play the way they've been playing with a high line but they should be able to uh make adjustments in game in the sense that if they concede early they need to be able to transition to something uh, else to move forward or if they're going to face a side like City they, they cannot be doing the same thing in every game That that's one thing they need to work on right now they yeah. need to be able to transition when necessary so if they have, if they can do pull that off, I think that will put them in a pretty good position. No, I agree. I think I'm a little. I think I'm, I'm confident that they might just they they'll do top five, which will be Champions League. So I think that's the thing, though. So they have to kind of make a choice between are we a cup team or are we a league team? Yeah. We really want them to be the former. Right? Okay, you can be, you can finish sixth, but if you win a Carabao Cup, your season is a success. Because again, I'm just. It may not be a success for United or Liverpool or, or, or Arsenal, but knowing their players, 
uh, AJ to or, or Prayag to say, but if it hurts, no in their place, if they can basically win a trophy, Carabao Cup or an FA Cup, and then finish six or seven, it's fine. At least the players, the team will have something to build on, and then they look forward to the future. But if they're not doing any of those, I mean, they're just finishing you know, fourth or fourth until the Champions League. What's the point? Like, it's been like what 20, 25 years, 30 years since they won a trophy. I don't know maybe, or what, what the time frame is, but like, you need people to kind of believe in your project. I think they've built the stadium like what six years ago, so when they moved into the stadium like four or five years ago. But apart from the talk of like managers changing in, or you know, comp, you know, all these guys coming in, and then you now know, fans coming in, there's been no consistency at all. There's nothing for first fans to look forward to. I've met a few of them when I was in London and I think I can I can see the disappointment on the face. They're, they're so hungry for something to show up. Like. Yeah, just one cup would end like an entire range of banter against them, right? Which has been going on for a very long time. All it takes is one cup and that yeah. would stop that and that would do so much for their fans. If Ange could just win maybe the Carabao Cup and then maybe collapse and leave, even that alone would be like a big success. So maybe he can be smart and just focus on one thing while making exactly. sure you finish top four. Yeah. Yeah, and I think yeah. that's exactly what Ken Kinedal did when he came into Liverpool in 2012. We were just kind of thought out, Star Hudson was sad. We didn't win anything, a trophy for 10 years. And Kenny was like, okay, first let's win a trophy and then build on top of it. I think he prioritized uh, us and everything. You know, he, he finished like eighth or something in the league or something like that. Work up again in the stand. Look at us, and then we lost in the FA Cup final against Chelsea for the 12 season. I think basically you have something for the fans to cheer about and then build on top of it. Yeah. At least for a club of like Tottenham Stature. Same can be said about Arsenal, but uh, let's not go No, but we don't uh, want uh, we don't want that. That is not going to satisfy us. Just winning the exactly. FA Cup. Or the Dude, like, uh, guys, Carabao you Cup. Have won FA Cup. Yeah, you guys have won FA Cup like what 10 times? No, no, I was, I, I, was, I, was, I was just. I was just kidding. Yeah, I was yeah. just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You weren't kidding. You suddenly realized <laughs> what you said and then you backed back. <laughs> Either that or what I said. 